Don't text and drive. The 2015 Mazda CX-5. The average guy. The CX-5 is stylish, well-built, roomy, and comfortable. And it's a Mazda. <laughs> so you know it's fun to drive. And you know the drill. Today I'm gonna be doing a review of the 2015 Mazda CX-5. Now Mazda has been making lots of noise lately because they've been building vehicles that are stylish, practical, and fun to drive. And the CX-5 is Mazda's five passenger, stuff hauling, gas sipping noise maker. Zoom, zoom. I love the exterior. It's bold, it's fluid and athletic with the jazzy signature Mazda grille. The interior of the CX-5 is also nicely done. There are high quality soft touch materials throughout the cabin and the build quality is excellent. This interior just looks and feels rich. It has a simple contemporary design with mostly matte surfaces. And it's a design that I believe will hold up well over time. And your time in the CX-5 will be enjoyable, thanks to comfortable supportive seating all around. I'm an average guy about 5'9", and there was plenty of room throughout the cabin for me. So five passengers, no problem. But what about your stuff? Well, there's 34 cubic feet of trunk space behind the back seat that expands to 65 cubes with the back seat folded flat. Okay, so let's talk about tech, convenience and safety, and we'll hit the low spots first. The vehicle's touchscreen display, while nice to have, is not as advanced or intuitive as some of the units you'll find in competitive models. And a satellite radio receiver is not a standard feature, even on the upgraded touring model that I'm testing here. And that's a bummer. That is a bummer. All right, now for the good news. There are just a host of convenience and safety features available for the CX-5. Like this integrated backup camera, standard on the Touring and Grand Touring models. Keyless entry and ignition, again, standard on the Touring models. And one of my favorite features, blind spot monitoring. That alerts you with a beep and flashing lights in your side mirrors if a vehicle or object is in one of your blind spots. Check out Mazda's website for info on even more advanced safety features like adaptive front lighting and City Smart brake support. All right, so now I'm gonna talk about what ultimately is most important, the driving experience. The Mazda CX-5 that I'm testing here is powered by a 2.5 liter four cylinder engine that generates 184 horsepower with 185 foot pounds of torque. It goes zero to 60 in eight seconds with all wheel drive while delivering an impressive 24 city, 30 highway MPG. And this is the vehicle's sweet spot. The CX-5 is just flat out fun to drive. It has a tight suspension, precise steering. It feels sporty and nimble. And the 2.5 liter engine delivers good power and smooth shifts for a comfortable, quiet ride. Zoom, zoom. Overall, the CX-5 is just a fun little vehicle to drive. I'm gonna have to give it a thumbs up, maybe two. So there you have it, another honest auto review from an average guy. If you're in the market for a small SUV that's stylish, practical, comfortable, and just a blast to drive, you definitely have to put the new Mazda CX-5 on your test drive list. And I'll see you next time. But in the meantime, keep pushing play.